sorry, I didn't see you there. I'm Harley West. I'm Shantara Brown, and make sure you check out this week's Tiger Times. You can read about Zach Powell and how he's helped the football team have such a strong season. Take a peek at the back page to find a story about how Smith Cotton Soccer beat Rockbridge for the first time in 10 years. You can find last week's copy of Tiger Times in the library or on the CW200 student media page. Thanks! Hey guys, Red Ribbon Week is next week. Red Ribbon Week is, is a drug prevention and awareness week. We're going to have a door decoration competition, so go ahead and start decorating your doors now because the, comp the judging is on Monday and it'll be judged by the mayor. And the prizes for that are going to be pizza, donuts, or small cakes, and the winner gets to choose. What's up, Smith Cotton? These are upcoming events for this week. Volleyball is a game today and cross country as a meet. Tomorrow, jazz and orchestra have a concert and boys have a soccer game in Orangeburg. Thursday, swim team has the West Central Conference and 340 FBLA has a meeting in the Commons. On Friday is the end of the first quarter. And then Saturday, we have boys soccer districts, we have con another cross country meet, volleyball sectionals, and the ACT one day workshop. Hope to see you there. Hi, I'm Taylor Fisher and I'm a senior on the Smith Cotton Girls Golf Team and I think our biggest accomplishment this year was realizing that we needed to work together and boost each other's confidence to make our season better as a team and I would describe our team as a family. We definitely work together um, to try and boost our confidence and throughout the season we got a lot closer realizing that this isn't just about individuals, it's about all of us working together. Um, one thing I'd like to leave for the team is to definitely push each other to do better. Um, you know that you have the potential, you have the skill to do this, you just have to know you can do it, and then you can. It's all in your head. I'm Jaden Kendrick, I'm Zach Powell, and we're senior football players here at Smith Cotton. And if had goals for the rest of the season, would definitely be winning the last WCC conference title and playing through Thanksgiving. As seniors, we want to leave a mark on Smith Cotton and show the underclassmen the drive and determination it takes to be better. Hi, I'm Alex Oswald. I'm a center forward for the men's soccer team here. And uh, so our biggest accomplishment of the season so far is probably beating Rockbridge and uh, beating Kickapoo for the first time in the uh, program's history. Um, Dynamically on our team, uh, we're a really close-knit group. We've been playing together for about 12 years, so uh, we know each other's strengths and our weaknesses, and I think we blend really well together, and that'll help us moving forward. Uh, our goals for the rest of the season, so of course we want to make it as far as we can. Uh, right now, districts is the aim, so win a district title, and from there we can move on, hopefully win sectionals, hopefully keep pushing all the way to the final four. I'm Elizabeth Matz. I'm the varsity one tennis senior player. Um, the biggest accomplishment for this year was going to sectionals and getting first in my conference and second in districts. Um, the dynamic of our team is just we work really well together. We always have each other's backs and are like supporting each other while watching each other play. Um, I hope that um, my team continues to work hard and just continues to have the determination to want to play and do well each year. Okay. <laughs> Hi, I'm Ethan. And I'm Alex. And we both run on the cross country team. So, uh, I think the biggest accomplishment uh, of our team this season so far would be winning our home meet. Uh, the dynamic team is really fun. It's just a big family. We all go run hard together. It's awesome. So, one of our goals for the rest of the season is to try to get our team past districts. Hi, I'm Felix from the swim team and uh, one of the biggest accomplishments of the season was actually winning our Tiger invite. Well, it all just takes a lot of dedication, a lot of our time. We have to really function as a team and we have to really get focused whenever our meets and, you know, get started. The goals for the rest of our season is probably to win conference and then ILCs. Something I hope to leave with, uh, with my team, even though I'm graduating, I would like to leave just a legacy behind of uh, what we have accomplished. Well, what I've accomplished in my three years and I just want to leave it. They can accomplish so much more in their three years if they really put the time and dedication into it.
Is that good? Mm -hmm. I'm Abby Ahern. And I'm Reagan Hulkett. And we're senior Smith Cotton softball players. The biggest accomplishment of our season this far has probably been beating Warrensburg at home. I would describe the dynamic of our team as a family and we really work hard together. Um, something we'd like to leave for next year is to just carry over our success into the next season. It was a really good season for us and we just hope that you guys can continue that and keep the legacy going as best as you can. <laughs> Hi, my name is Taylor Burlingame. I'm a Smith Cotton senior and I play for Smith Cotton volleyball. Our biggest accomplishment this season would probably be just working as a team. Our goal is to basically get past the first round. We play Jeff City and we've had a good competition with them. Um, something I hope to leave with the team, I just want them to know that if they play as a team, they'll be great next year. So.